Alright peoples, I know that was a quick return to the big screen here. Um, I received a parcel today from my beautiful friend, Alana. Now Alana um, lives in Madrid um, and this she's made for my birthday. Now my birthday was on the 19th of Feb, so a little a couple of weeks ago, but you know, it's all good. Um, and I can't wait to get into this and have a look at what we have here. I don't want, ah, here we go, because I don't want to cut it. I know, I'm hoarding more stuff and I'm trying to clean the craft room because I hoard too much. But, you know. Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, wow. Oh, Eleanor. Oh, isn't that just beautiful? Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's one of her pillow journals. Oh, God, isn't she so clever? Okay, I'm going to lift it up so you can all see. She has hand sewn everything. She's done a bit of winding with a bit of trim through the lace. It's so soft. It actually feels like a beautiful pillow. Oh, wow. Her layering is just so beautiful. Then we have up the top the same. And down the bottom. And this is a bit of a pocket in here. So let's go and have a look. Oh, oh look how she's got it all. It's one of those fob things that I got no idea how to use aren't I a bit a bit simple let's have a look how do I open it Eleanor <laughs> I don't want to break it here we go yep easy as that and there's another one. There's two more. Just bear with me, everybody, while I work out how to open the pillow. Oh, what a trick, Prezi. This is awesome. Here we go. And in there. Okay, so in here, she has made a journal. Oh, my goodness. I'll show you the inside if you can see there's a bit of a bit of a satchel in there and it's so soft it's all lined it's just beautiful oh how sweet oh my god I love it Eleanor you you're just amazing <laughs> oh okay all right so we have a journal here i don't know if i've got it upside down and back to front yet but we will find out as we go along i think that's the bottom oh so we've got a crochet doily around the outside and i believe this fabric will probably be from um, denise's store a tattered dream um, i'll put the link to a tattered dream in the description box as well for everybody because I do know that Eleanor does get and purchase quite a bit of product from Denise so it's quite possible there is a lot of um, bits and pieces from Denise's store in here that you all might be thinking how did she make that okay so all right so the doily comes apart so we'll move that and I did read the note Eleanor thank you very much for my birthday wishes and of course I forgive you. Don't be so silly. <laughs> All right, so here's some more of her layering. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, soft and squishy. And that's the back. Oh. 
absolutely beautiful. Look at, th oh, look at that for yumminess. Oh my goodness, Eleanor, you've spoilt me and I'm lucky that your birthday is in March. I believe it's the 8th of March off the top of my head. So I've still got time to finish your little prezzy off too. All right, so here we go. The inside is a pocket. And she's got a handmade tag. I'll pull that out in a minute. Isn't it so cute? And she's just layered materials in here. As little flips. It's like a snippet book. Isn't it cute? I love this fabric. It's it's the sheerness and the feel of it. It's absolutely beautiful. So there's a little snippet book that she's made with vintage music sheet and trims and fabrics. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? And she's sewn across the top to keep it all together. Now it fits in there, so we've got a pocket here. Now, let me see. Did you... Think what it looks like is the glassine bag is actually adhered so it's part of the pocket um, and then in here there are some little stamp stickers aren't they gorgeous oh. put those in there And she's done an altered paper clip, some flowers, and some trim from Denise's store. It's absolutely beautiful. And I'm going to pick it up and show you the layering in the bottom corner. This is a flower, and there's a stick pin in there. Very tiny doily in the background and some tags and this mint trim is from Denise's store as well from a tattered dream so that's just beautiful okay so next page some more gorgeous layering and we have a leaf two different types of leaf in a glassine bag that looks like it's been embossed and then we have some little bits and pieces in here it's good for um, using in your journals which I do have to make use of one of my journals that I purchased and start writing in it I should do a flip through one day of all my purchased journals really I have got some really well, I think it sits in here I think I sits in here like that did I do it right ah. and then the layering on the top here it's beautiful the fabrics at the top there Eleanor this is gorgeous I'm probably going to go too slow but well Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And we've got another pocket in here. Okay, so vintage lady there, and she's just sewn some lace on the front to create this pocket. Always remember that the strength within you is greater than any storm. <laughs> There's a pocket in here, and we've got some vintage stamps. And this tape here of the Regency Ladies, um, I, um, I got some from her in our last swap. 
I've just forgotten the name of this store, but I will put the link down um, in the description box. <clears throat> so much to look at. Okay, so we've got another pocket here with the mason jar that's been embossed and stamped. Some fine little fibres. <clears throat> and this is also from Denise's store. And that's an old book page. Wow, it's really old. <laughs> oh, it's a pocket. Okay, all right, let's see. That's a library card. Oh, it's another snippet book. <laughs> That's lovely. Mm. So, another snippet book with some stamping. She's very, very talented, Eleanor things that she creates just blows my mind. Unbelievable. Wow. Oh, sorry. I'm touching everything. It just it feels so beautiful when I haven't been in my own craft room in a very long time. Not the whole want to do anything in general. <laughs> So the doily and the glassine, I think I'll just stop talking. Sorry, just wipe away the tears before they drop onto the beautiful pages. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Little envelope. <laughs> All these little quotes. done down here I'll just move those she's rolled up some some vintage paper into like a scroll it's really pretty and it looks like I've got some some vintage things in here so I think I'm meant to open this we will soon see maybe not is it meant to just sit there is it I don't want to open it and ruin it. I think it was just meant to sit there, so I might put all that back in a moment. It's absolutely beautiful. <clears throat> Look at this, isn't it stunning? It's dried lavender. Oh wow. I 
A little garment pin and a little key charm. Another little snippet book. These will be from Denise's store as well. That's the little glassine bag and we've got a little another snippet book with the vintage papers. Oh look at that, isn't it beautiful? Should have brought my box of tissues with me, shouldn't I? <laughs> Altered paper clip. Oh, it's got a bunny stamp. <laughs> oh, how cute. Just a little altered guest check here. Also, they'll be from Denise's store as well, I would assume. <clears throat> okay, what has she written here? Oh, 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 that's lovely. That I know where you got that from. That 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 makes me laugh. That's really cool. <laughs> and then we have some vintage ephemera. This is genuine vintage ephemera, and it is French ephemera. This is awesome. Oh, wow. So we'll pop that back in there. <laughs> I like that. That's really cute. <laughs> oh. Let's pop that one back there. All the layering. <clears throat> you can see just some trim there, a little rusty um, bell. And a rusted little garment pin. Oh my goodness. Some more vintage ephemera. Isn't that so sweet? Oh my goodness. Eleanor, you've spoilt me. I love this. It's absolutely gobsmacking gorgeous. I don't know how you found the time to actually sit and do this, knowing how busy you have been with your business and your little girl who is just so adorable. You're a superwoman. Some more French ephemera there. Awesome. She's so pretty. There's some collaging here. And we have one of Denise's glassine or well, waxed paper bags. And the doilies will be from a tattered dream as well. So what has she got in this side here? So she's given me a length of lace. Isn't that beautiful? How gorgeous. And these, I know these envelopes are from Denise's store. It's a Tim Holtz clip on there and it just says wishes. Oh, I know those are those, um, those little, what do you call them? The little fairy those things I <laughs> gone blank but you all know what they are that's the in yeah she's broken those down so they're my wishes <laughs> I think my first big wish is to find some normality whatever that is and was <laughs> oh, it'll come back Sorry, this is going to be a, be a bit of a longish video. I'm just a bit slow with moving these days. 
and I want to see absolutely everything and touch everything. It'll be trim from Denise's store. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at the layering. I love the grey. Isn't that beautiful? The colour tones, the grey and the cream and the white. Oh, I love that. And then we have a little peg with a fabric heart that she's put onto there and she's opened this side of the bag let's just do do this first this is one of those flip envelopes from Denise's store oh isn't that beautiful she's one of my favorite vintage images she's so beautiful and then in here did you We have another little saying. <laughs> I love that saying, by the way, too. I'm just not going to read it out because it will probably yeah, make me end up in tears. <laughs> and I think you all deserve a bit more of my attention than me sobbing. Oh, some stamps. This is amazing. I hope I'm catching all of this for you all. Just a book page little tuck spot there. Oh my goodness. I like the use of how you've done these glycine bags. That's adorable. Some mushrooms stamped onto just a ticket there. And that'll be from Denise's store. So she's just got a little bit of fabri fabric there stapled on. Absolutely gorgeous. Some more vintage graph paper. A tag. Oh, wow. Some linen and then we have another tuck spot here with some more tickets and tags beautiful elegant trim it's gorgeous and I'll turn it this way so you can see oh it's beautiful and then just with some waxed paper she's embellished a library card and she has stamped mushroom on the fabric a little bit of chain there and just some layering with buttons and trims in there and that sits in there isn't that adorable oh that's rice paper oh wow oh it's beautiful and it feels amazing Oh, yes, and there you go. She's done the other side too. Wow. She's so very clever. Beautiful. Um, I think I need to put this back on here because that all held that together I believe from memory and then we have another pocket here and she's made a little flip oh, look at that <laughs> I believe that's um, from dreams etc these little tabs courage is found in unlikely places <laughs> oh isn't that just gorgeous Oh, it tucks in here. And another one here. It's a beautiful image. Absolutely stunning image. 
Well, and then you turn it over, the inventory tag will be from a tattered dream. She's used it as a tuck spot on the glassine envelope. I'm dropping everything now. And then we have a little journaling card. Oh, that was on my Facebook page. <laughs> Oh, that's just beautiful. A little snippet that I had posted on my Facebook page for my children. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Okay, so she's sewn the glassine bag up. Okay, yep. Because she sewed the image on. Oh, that is just gorgeous. So adorable. Oop, I got that all stuck and then we have down here on this paper clip she's altered another little paper clip isn't she clever oh that is just adorable and then up in this top corner she's got some layering So little jar full of little beads, just some trims. And then this page we've got more layering and more pockets. <laughs> so I'll just pull them out so you can see the page. All that layering. And these are the pockets in here absolutely gorgeous and this little glassine bag is just loaded with looks like vintage stamps oh. i won't go through let's see we'll go through all of them there we have that one Sorry, my hand too close there. Well, that's upside down, I think. And there's that one. Then there's, yeah, there's that one. That one. Ooh, is it going to focus? There we go. They're tiny. Don't think the camera's gonna focus on some. Let's see how we go. Gosh, the tiny stamps, aren't they? Wow. And there's that one. And then there's that one. That goes in there. Then we have a little envelope. Which a little sticker on a day to remember and that's on there is there any no it's all sealed up that's really cute nice ribbon You have found some of the best quotes that I have put on my Facebook page <laughs> since October. You're making me laugh. Oh, her layering. So sweet. Absolutely gorgeous. And she's got a little tiny envelope here. It's a ticket with a um, film strip on it. And in this little envelope, we have little tiny snippets. <laughs> Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, how adorable. Oh, I love it. That's so gorgeous. Goes in under there. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, okay, I get it. It's on. It's an alt, an altered clip. Let's see. Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. So let's pop that back on there. Then on this side. Oh, good lord! You look what she's done. She's got little snippets of tags and fabric and trims on the tag. Oh my goodness, that is adorable. And in the pocket here, we've got some more vintage tickets and some journaling cards. That's the things you think of, Eleanor. Absolutely stunning. And I'll just hold the page up so you can see what she's done. We're at the 30 minute mark. Sorry people, but this is just stunning. And then this page here, we have a pocket here, and it looks like she's made some bits and pieces that have gone in the pocket. And again, her layering. So we've got washi tape on the page, one of the rosettes. I think they might be from A Tattered Dream. I know I sent some to her in our last swap, so it could even be that. Um, we have a little tassel bead here on, looks like some tatting. And then with her layering on, on the bag. Oh, it's just adorable. I'm not sure. If you... Yep. Okay. So she's fixed the bag. And then all of this was inside the bag. We have a butterfly, an arrow, another floral journaling card and another saying from my Facebook page again it's <laughs> very cute I love what you've done here this oh, this is so hilarious I love it it's beautiful and then I believe that's a stamped image on some vintage paper here and she's just sewn the fabrics down onto a tag that she's made Oh, she's amazing. So very talented. Well, this was the only birthday present I got this year, Alana. So thank you very much. I love it. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? Love that. Then you flip that over, and then there she is again. She's stunning. And then we have another page of collage.